I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to Siamese Mahjong, look for links in the video description below so you can learn the fundamentals. This version is very challenging. Two players play two hands at one time. You get a lot of tiles, which is why I like to practice by playing solitaire. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. Three, two, one. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player 1 will get 28 tiles. Player 2 will get 27 tiles. Then we're going to look at each player's hands, see where the strengths lie. Hopefully we'll be able to pick out a few categories to play, or maybe even pick a hand. Everybody has their tiles. This player almost had too many. Basically it's four, four, six minus one. That's how I work it out in my mind, so I don't have to count every tile. Here we have 28. Let's see what we can do with these tiles for player one. For this player, we have jokers, pair dragons, south, three, five, seven, eight, nine, pair, nine. Here's a Kong of fours, pair of sevens, one, five, six, seven, eight, nine, pair, pair. Look at this, we have no gaps for five through nine. That's only seven tiles though. Let's see. Here we have a Kong of fours. I would want to use that. I think I would play two, four, six, eight here so we could use that Kong. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. We need two dots. Now we need to figure something out for the rest of these tiles. I'm kind of thinking big odds. So let's keep little tiles and consecutive tiles up there. One, five, seven, one, one, three, five, five, seven, nine. Let's see, little tile, consecutive dragons. Seven, one. Okay, let's see. Big odds. Five, seven, nine pair hand. Five, seven, nine pair hand, maybe. We could use these for joker bait for this hand. If we can get a five dot. We'd have to throw away a nine. Let's see here. We have no flowers. We do have some potential for a pear hand. Eight, nine, eight, nine dragons, but we have no red dragon and no flowers. This requires no flowers. All we really need is a two dot in here and then maybe a six or an eight and that would be leveraging the four. Maybe we should keep the three just in case something consecutive comes in. So down here, what about 
6789 consecutive run potential. I think I would hold this for a potential if the big odds doesn't work out. Let's start by discarding these right here. Hold that for joker bait. Play 2468 second hand down and then big odds. And we have consecutive options. Let's see what we can do for player two. Look at all those dragons, red and white. If we had flowers, we could play five, six pair hand. I actually think that is possible. Five, six pair hand. Let's just look. We're severely lacking flowers, but we only need two. I bet you we'll draw some. Okay, up here, ones, maybe, I was thinking like numbers with ones, but we're using the dragons here. Maybe we could play the like number quint, discard these, use this as joker bait. Okay, I think that's possible. Like number quint with ones, fourth one down, quint, quint, kong. Five, six, dragon, five, six, dragon, pair hand. Second from the bottom under singles and pairs. Let's see what happens. We're going to start by discarding here, south. Nine dot, let's get rid of the east. South. Looks like neither player once wins. Drawing for player two. We got a white dragon. Well, we'll just keep it and see what happens. Let's discard two bam. Seven crack. Okay, that's an odd. Let's keep it. We have options. Let's discard three crack. Two dot. Maybe we could play one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two with flowers. The thing is we need flowers here, but we can keep them just to see what happens. Let's discard nine dot. This is concealed. Two crack. Discard. North. Oh, flower. We're gonna probably use that up here, maybe. Let's see, well, let's just gather. We'll keep gathering. You know what, maybe we could play one, three, one, three, five, seven, nine. Use that as joker bait. There's potential there. Oh, we were gonna maybe do six, seven, eight, nine, nine. That would be the consecutive run hand, fourth one down under consecutive run. Let's discard the eight crack. We're gonna put these up here. We don't know where those are gonna go yet. 
So eight crack, we're gonna draw. Nine crack, maybe we could play a year hand up here. Two thousand and nineteen with ones and nines. We have no nine bam. Let's get rid of the eight dot. That we don't need. What we want here are flowers. This is Joker Bait discards. Options. Drawing here. Flower. Okay, I think we're gonna need to change our plan here. Because the pear hand down here does not use flowers. So let's see. I wonder if we could, hmm, the four, a Kong of fours with nothing to go with it. Isn't that kind of the way it goes sometimes? Let's see here. What could we do? Use this down here. Two, four, six, eight, Joker bait, flowers flowers with odds. There's one hand that can use flowers with odds. Five, seven, nine in one suit. <laughs> okay, well, or like numbers with nines, like numbers with sevens. Let's just get rid of the three dot and see what happens. We're going to draw. Seven bam, that is not a keeper. Seven bam. Eight crack, we already threw that. East, those will be easy picks and discards. East. Five bam, five six five six dragon. We have the pairs right there, though. We really don't even need those because we have pairs. Okay. Well, maybe what we should do is play the year hand with dragons. The year hand with dragons that still requires flowers, though. Two thousand and nineteen with two kongs of dragons. Maybe we could switch to like numbers with fives and a year hand with dragons. We would still have to throw away a pung of ones. Let's just keep everything and discard these. Eight crack. You don't have to decide until you run out of discards, really. Let's draw. Joker. Okay, well that's encouraging. Two dot, four dot, six bam, eight bam, two, four, six, eight, second hand down. Down here, let's see. Seven, eight, seven, 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 like numbers with sevens. And then Joker bait. We don't need all this Joker bait. Let's see here. What else could we do? Like numbers with sevens. If we get a five dot, we could maybe play five, seven, seven, nine opposite dragon. This would be the fourth hand down. We'd have to use these for joker bait. Either way, we really didn't use the ones. So let's go ahead and discard the ones. One bam. Drawing here. Eight dot, that's not a keeper. Eight dot. Five bam. Okay, five bam. Five, seven, nine, five, seven, nine. Potential pair hand if we can get a five dot. Let's discard one bam. We need a pair of five dots and then we would discard the seven. That 579 pair hand is the third one down. And we'd have to throw away one of these too. 
Well, let's just keep going and see what happens. We're going to draw four bam. We really don't need that. We don't need any of these up here. We do have four, five, six, five, six, seven. Let's discard seven crack. Down here, one thing we could consider is five, seven, seven, nine, and pung that. That would leave a lot of, that would leave one, two, two more pair. At least playing the pair hand, we would actually have one pair here and break out two pairs. So either way, we're breaking up pairs. Okay, well, let's, let's change this whole idea here. What about if we give up on two, four, six, eight, and play two, five, seven, nine hands? Use this as joker bait. Let's just see what it looks like. There is still potential for like numbers with sevens. Kong, Kong, one away, one away from set instead of five, seven, nine. But then that really messes with this down here unless we played eight, nine, eight, nine dragon, joker bait, discard, joker bait. Okay, five, seven, nine. Let's focus on five, seven, nine and like numbers and get rid of the fours. So we were wondering about taking the seven. Yep, so we have an opportunity to, to Kong the seven. If we played a five, seven, nine hand, I would probably play the second hand down, five, seven, seven, nine, where the seven would probably be a Kong, five, Pong, seven, Kong, and then seven, Pong, nine, Kong, but we're really light. I don't think I would do that. I think I would rather play eight, nine, dragon, like numbers with sevens, joker bait. And just give up on the, the big odd hand. Let's draw green dragon. That's a keeper. Okay, let's discard four dot. Drawing up here, four crack. Okay, let's discard four crack. We just got through the second wall. We're going into the third wall now, middle game. And this is a real challenge. Here we're playing consecutive run. And here we're playing like numbers with sevens, changing from odds. Here we're trying to play the five, six dragon pair hand. Here we're trying to play a quint. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're going to see if this works. Four bam. No. Well, let's get rid of the four dot. This player didn't even flinch. Let's draw. Okay, we got a seven. We don't need it. Let's get rid of four crack. We got like three hands going here. Let's draw. Red dragon. Red dragon, okay. I, 
I don't think we really need it. Let's keep getting rid of these fours, unfortunately. Six crack. We got a keeper. All we need is a flower and a six dot. This is a potential year hand. I would sometimes I'll turn tiles upside down for plan B. Oh, this is not a plan. Oh, wait, we want this up here. There for the quint. I just wonder if maybe if we can get nine bams, I think that year hand would be even better. And flowers, of course, we need flowers, flowers. Oh, let's see, four, 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 three. Discarding four bam. Nobody wants it. We're going to draw. Six bam. <laughs> Six bam. Okay, let's see. Well, we can get rid of this four dot. So now we have... Five, six, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine flowers. Okay, let's rearrange a little here. Let's just see what it looks like if we put it in order. Another thing I was thinking here is we could do four, five, six, seven, seven. This would be the fourth hand down under consecutive run then we could do eight nine dragon let's just see how that looks I think that looks pretty good. There's only one four bam out. We could Kong, Kong, be ready to win. Here, Kong, here or here, Pung. I think this looks really good. It's amazing how you could make really just about anything work. But I think that utilizes all the multiples but one. So let's go with it. So we discarded a four dot. It's this player's turn, I think. Four, 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 three. Okay, we're good now. Consecutive run, consecutive run. This is consecutive run number five. This is consecutive run number four. We need a four bam. This player threw it, so if they draw it, they'll throw it again. Let's draw up here. Six crack, we've already got it. All we need up here is a six dot and a flower. They're so close. Let's, let's get rid of, okay, let's think about plan B. Five, six, five, six. Like numbers with fives. Let's hold the five. Like numbers with sevens, like numbers with sixes. That's even better. Let's hold these and get rid of these and have a fallback to like numbers with sixes and dragons. Like numbers with sixes and dragons. The flowers is the hard part here. At least the quint doesn't use any flowers. All right, let's discard, let's discard five bam. Drawing for this player, nine bam. Okay, well, that feels good. Pung, we can Kong, we could Kong and we could Pung. Pung, Kong, Kong, Pung, done. Let's get rid of red dragon. They're done here. We're going to draw three crack. I don't think that's going to be helpful. I think we need to rethink this quint. 
Let's visit it in a minute. Let's draw here. Flower. Okay, this hand is ready to win on an eight bam. Four, five, six, seven, seven. Seven bam. Might as well. Seven bam. Two, three, year. Discards. Drawing here. Three bam. We want four, five, six. We don't need a three. Four bam. Discard. Second one out. We need a pair. Five bam. We don't need it. Let's discard eight dot. This is a weakness. Two dot. What about one, two, one, two, if we can get flowers? Let's discard the three dot. We need that four bam. West. We need that four bam badly. Let's draw. Oh my goodness. We got the six dot. One, two, three, four, five, six. We need a flower. Okay, up here. This is not coming in. 2019. 2019, one nine. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, flowers. Let's give up on the dragons or decide because here we really don't need this dragon. You only need two dragons in the like number hand. Let's discard green dragon. Down here we only need a pung. East. Oh, geez. Five dot. We do not need that. If nothing else, we want sixes. We can switch to like numbers with sixes. And then use the fives as joker bait. Let's draw. Five crack. All right. Five crack. So... We do not really need this five bam. Let's discard five bam. Three crack. Nine dot. We need a four bam. Let's discard nine dot. Okay. West. Okay, let's cross our fingers for this four bam or a seven. Nope, one bam. Five dot. White dragon, don't need it. White dragon, up here, I would not take it. We have no flowers. For that first hand, we wouldn't even need four white dragons. The second hand down, we don't have any nine bams. We would use our only jokers. I would not do that. I would just let it go. Two bam. All right. We have no, the one bams are all out. Two bam. Three dot. Three bam. Okay, cross your fingers for the four or seven. West. Nine crack. All right. 
a little movement up here. 2019 two zero one nine maybe we could have taken it I didn't see that because I was thinking one two one two okay we can use a joker we do have the white dragons down here but this is a possibility one two one two we have to make a choice now we are having the hardest time getting flowers, but one flower will do it for a pear hand. I would stick with it. Because this is used down here, I don't think I would play the year hand. I think I would try for one, two, one, two, one, two consecutive. Maybe we could even do one two dragon and use jokers for the dragon we still need flowers badly let's keep the sixes for like number potential if the flowers don't come in surely we would draw one don't you think let's get rid of the nine crack primarily because we're using dragons here let's draw two crack up here we could call that for a pung and commit we could pung here too let's do it we're gonna just commit to something we can use this as a flower pair pair we could pung here discard these nine crack all right we're committed now yes there's a gap but this is just taken too long we need to make some kind of a commitment there. All right, we're gonna we're gonna push it. Let's draw. Two bam. One crack. <laughs> oh, we need pairs there. We don't need that. Let's discard white dragon. I should have gotten rid of the ones and held the white for like numbers with sixes. Too late now. Let's draw joker okay that's helpful that is helpful if we can just get a kong in here we'll be ready to win on a four let's discard five crack drawing up here west three bam we want the four bam here we go Two crack, exchanging my own. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Okay, flowers. Yeah, that's something else. Okay, let's discard one dot. Okay, one, two, one, two, flowers. Three bam. Stinking three bam. Okay, we just got through the third while we're going into the end game. I would play to win really for everyone even though we have a gap all we need is one flower here and one flower there two flowers here really seven crack Kong Okay, they made it. Now, this player will throw a four because they already did. Let's discard five crack. Drawing up here. Six dot. Let's get rid of the one crack. Okay, look at all these sixes. Okay, we'll just hold off. If we can get one flower, we'll be ready on a pear hand. Flower. We don't need it. We really don't need it. We need three for the hand with the dragon. Flower. 
up here. Well, we're not ready. We can't take it. We need a we need a Kong of flowers. Three crack. Oh, flower. Oh, painful. Joker. Oh, okay. Now, all we need is a flower here. Let's see. Two, let's see. Four, four, eight versus one, uh, four, four. Oh, my goodness. Let's see. We have too many sixes. Let's get rid of the six dot because there's already a white dragons out and we could use this six for the pungs and still maybe make this pair hand work. Six dot. Two bam. North. Eight crack. Nine dot. Flower. 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 Thank you. Since this player is throwing them, we can take it. We got it. Okay. This hand is ready on a two dot. Let's stick with the pair hand. Six crack. So we have one, two, three flowers out. Let's draw. One crack. Four crack. I cannot believe they've only drawn one flower. That is crazy. North. Surely we'll get one flower. Two dot. Okay, now we have a mahjong here. Let's see if we can do double mahjong. Let's hold off just for a couple more picks. Six bam. This is kind of crazy there. Let's draw one dot up here. South. Oh my goodness. Drawing here. Four crack. Okay. Do you think we can draw a flower? Red dragon. Oh, painful. Very painful drawing. Nine bam, we got a keeper. Okay, now ready to win on an eight, ready to win on a four. Discarding nine crack. All right, now up here, we're gonna draw and declare. I think it is, it is just too difficult to wait. We're gonna declare, because who knows if we're gonna get the flower. So we're gonna declare. No double mahjong. It's just insane. Okay, there. Six bam. Down here. South. Drawing up here. Look, we're going to draw a flower. How much you want to bet? There it is. Can you believe that? Oh my goodness, I cannot believe that. <laughs> Discarding seven dot. I did not want to lose out and now we get it. Oh my goodness. Okay, drawing. Eight bam. We got Mahjong. Okay, let's discard nine crack. Maybe this player can get double Mahjong. We need a four bam and this player will throw it. Okay, I should have declared because this player has a Mahjong. I should have declared that joker. Now that is a red flag. They're throwing a joker down here. We're going to draw. We're going to declare. So I'm going to put this back. Well, you know what? I'm going to put this back here. 
because that way you can at least see the winning hand on top. Okay, so we'll put this up here for declaring. Because you can't see what's back here. You can't see this back here. I don't know how to fix that. I'll have to figure out how to raise that up there. I have no idea what I'm going to do, but I'll just let you know that there's a Kong of Sevens back there. So now we're going to discard here. Six crack. Now we have a 25er and a 25er. So they basically wash each other out. So it's a matter of this, these two hands drawing up here. Six dot. Drawing here, we need a four bam mahjong, double mahjong, or not double mahjong, but they got both. Wow, that's just kind of crazy how that all worked out. You never know when your opponent is going to have their second hand and they got it. So timing is everything with Siamese mahjong. You never know when the other player is going to have a double mahjong. So this player had a single, this player had a single, they cancel each other out. This player had the second Mahjong, so this is doubled. So this is a 50 point hand. So this player owes this player 50 points and they self picked, so no penalty. I think I'm too optimistic when it comes to flowers. Player two could not get a flower. There are eight and there's only two players. So many of those flowers were at the end of the wall, but when you wait towards the end of the game for a win, you may lose out because if your opponent wins two hands first, you're out of luck. That was really, really challenging. There are some really unique strategies when it comes to Siamese Mahjong. It is quite different than playing a four player game. I mean, the hands themselves are the same. The colors, letters, numbers, the blocks, uh, that type of thing, that's all the same. No Charleston. Other than that, the strategies are quite different when you play two hands at once. If you haven't tried it yet, I hope you give it a try. It is really a lot of fun and more and more people are playing Siamese Mahjong. There's even a way to play online now. Look for my email in the video description below if you wanna try it out. Send me an email, I can send you a 30 day VIP code. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers, including the flowers.